the Prime Minister of Sao Tome and Principe Petrus Trovoada on Tuesday held the end of a long period of government coalition after the straight out victory of Evaristo Cavallo. The head of government said the conditions now exist for a better cohesion with the government and for better institutional relations including parliament and courts. He also urged all the people to work to move the country forward. Cavallo, who is 74 years old, won the second round of Sunday's presidential election with just over 42,000 votes out of about 111 registered in the small archipelago, according to official results. Final results are expected in the coming days. As in Portugal, the former colonial power, the presiding arbitrator does not govern, leaving the real power to the prime minister. In this country, of a population of 200,000 people independent since 1975, outgoing President Manuel Pinto da Costa made no statement from the unsurprising victory of his opponent, who was the sole runner in the second round. Last week, Pinto da Costa pulled out of the race, citing election fraud. He urged his supporters to boycott the polls. Voter turnout was low at about 46 percent, and about 10,000 ballots, according to the Electoral Commission were either spoiled or blanked.